Hi everybody, my name is Dave Marsh. I'd like to welcome you to this Matrix Quick Tip tutorial. And today we're gonna to take a look at the navigation structure in Matrix X. Now before I begin, I'd first like to mention that because each MLS has slightly different requirements, the system that we'll be using during this tutorial may differ slightly from the one that you're currently working with. Nevertheless, the functionality is the same. And for the most part, whatever you see during this tutorial, you'll easily recognize in your own system. Now, for anyone who's already familiar with Matrix, you'll notice that for the most part, your navigation has remained unchanged from your previous version. In these side-by-side -side comparisons, we see that all that's really been updated is that the main menu has now been consolidated with a more efficient user workflow. For example, by removing the home link from the main menu, users now see a cleaner header while still being able to access the home page directly from the My Matrix link instead. And for any reason, if you'd like to continue using the home link, it's now called Dashboard and is available from the My Matrix submenu. All right, so the other change to the My Matrix menu has been the removal of the settings section. And this is because your matrix settings are now a part of a brand new utility menu, conveniently located by simply clicking on your name. And this makes sense considering these are your settings. And for the most part, any changes to this section will have a direct impact on how your system behaves. Also from the utility menu, team members will notice the link to access their team leader system. And this has been moved from the pop-up that originally appeared when their full name was clicked. Below that, you'll notice that access to the help section and the logout link have been moved to the utility menu as well. And again, this is simply part of the effort to consolidate the main menu to only include links to the system's core functionality. And finally, the last header item that's been updated is the addition of a dedicated notification area. In this example, you notice a badge that indicates that I currently have one new matrix alert, which in this case happens to be a concierge auto email with listings that are currently waiting for approval. All right, so this concludes this Matrix Quick Tip tutorial. I'd like to thank you for watching and hope that you can join me for another session. Take care.